Hi everybody, thanks for checking out this video. We are having a gloomy fall day. Fall is finally here after 80 degree weather literally two weeks ago. So the lighting's a little rough. I look a little rough, so just bear with me, but we're gonna go ahead and do this. I debated whether doing a post or a video for this information, but I think maybe a video might be better. I know some people just love videos, I personally do. So I wanna share with you some of my favorite beauty tools and products that have helped really kind of keep my skin under control. I deal with congested pores, hormonal acne, regular acne, blackheads, and a while ago I was using retinol. And if you know that product, it's literally a miracle in a tube, but there are a lot of times when you just can't use that kind of product or maybe it's too harsh for your skin. And I was really surprised once I had to stop using that, how many products and tools it took to replace the one product. And if you deal with those kind of skin issues like I do, you're always on the hunt for something that's not not only gonna be nice to your skin, but it's actually going to work. So this might be helpful for you if you're in the same boat. So first up, I'll show you the box so you can see. Um, the first and most effective for me has been the PMD Personal Microderm. This one is the Pro. It retails for about 200. I got it for, I think around 100 for a sale. So you might check out, you know, holidays are coming up. You might be able to find it um, at a discount. And I've never paid that much for a tool. I was super skeptical, but I was kind of desperate at that point. The texture of my skin was like getting pretty rough and I felt like my whole face was basically just full of congested pores. And this by far I think has been the best tool that I've ever bought. Well, def actually it is the best tool I've ever bought. Um, I noticed that it keeps congested pores at bay, it keeps the blackheads at bay. It helps you know smooth out the texture of my skin when I don't use it I definitely notice a difference especially just the congested pores start coming back I use the recommended um, once a week uh, I think this head is for more sensitive skin which I have and I wanted to kind of start out you know for something that's just a little bit nicer on my skin and not too rough definitely watch the instructional video when I'm not paying attention I definitely will get like I'll go too hard right here on my cheeks and then I'll get red streaks and it feels kind of burnt. So make sure you watch the video, be careful. But this is my favorite product. When I'm not using this um, in between, that's usually like my Sunday night you know, routine. I use a more gentle exfoliator. This one is Tata Harper's Regenerating Cleanser. It is still a bit pricey, although she does usually have sales or if you go on like Credo Beauty or Derm Store, they usually have some kind of sale so you can get it at a discount. But this one is just really gentle. You wanna be careful if you're using something like the Microderm, which does a really thorough job, but you don't want to you know, overstress your skin. So something like this is just more gentle. I would highly recommend. This is also part of my double cleanse routine. And so that moves on to my next tool, the first thing that I do when I'm cleansing is I use this. This is also PMD and I have to cheat because I forget. This is the Clean Smart Facial Cleansing Device. This is 100. I happened to get this um, in a subscription box and I had previously the Clarisonic. I think that they're gone now, but I didn't really see a difference with the Clarisonic. You had to change out the brush heads. I think they were like $30 a pop. They were always wet. And I just didn't find it cost effective or that it really worked. But with this, you can just pop out new batteries. You don't have to change out the head. It's really easy to clean. Um, you know, the bristles aren't wet the next time you go to use it. And I have actually seen a difference with this. It's not a huge difference, but it is noticeable. And I use this with my oil cleanser. I think you could probably use any cleanser with this, but this is what I use with my first cleanser before I get in the shower. And then after, when I get out of the shower, I use the Tata Harper. And I feel like that with the PMD has really just kept everything under control. When I'm not really on top of double cleansing or exfoliating, I see the results right away. So I have to be really diligent. The third tool, that I really like. This is from Herbivore. 
I know I'm going to say the name wrong. I think it's pronounced Gua Sha. You've probably seen these. They come in different shapes. Um, I've seen claims that they're like a kind of like natural alternative to Botox. I don't know how I feel about that claim. Um, I find it more for just really helping relax the muscles, especially in my brow and along my chin. I tend to like grind my teeth and clench my jaw a lot so my muscles get really tight. And I find that really helpful to kind of like sweep it over the jaw muscles. And then also the thing that I use it for the most is I was getting this like lovely double chin right here. Um, and a few months ago, I started to become really diligent about using this tool to help that. And I have noticed a difference. I, I saw a lot of videos. TikTok is a great place to check out, you know, different ways to use this, you know, the, the different shapes and how you can, you know, massage your face. Um, but I saw that it's a lymphatic drainage issue. And so what I do is just, I start where my double chin is and I sweep across and down. And I have noticed that it is significantly decreased, but I have to be really consistent with it. So I use this not only for that, but again, just, you know, the brow and the cheek to help relax my muscles. Especially great because we have a lot of things up in the air, the holidays are coming, you know, COVID's still going on, and you're probably just in general stressed. So, you know, what better way to just help, you know, you kind of relax at night as part of your routine than to use something like this. Do use this with an oil so that you're not hurting your skin. You know, don't go too hard. I recommend going on TikTok. There are tons of videos that you can watch to see what works for you. I'm not gonna give a demonstration because I'm not an expert. I'm sure I'm probably doing it wrong. But you know, there's lots of things that you can check out to see what works. The last thing I wanna talk about um, is a product. I've been using this for about a year. I think this is like my fifth tube of it. This is Biosance, um, the Squalene and Lactic Acid Resurfacing Night Serum. If you want a retinol alternative that is not harsh on your skin, that is more natural, I think this is a great option to try out. It's decently affordable. I know it looks small. It actually lasts a decent amount of time. I think it's around $60, but this website always has deals. So I think most likely you'll find either it in a kit and save money or you'll get like a 20% off. Biosense always has deals on their products on their website. So check out the website. I like this product because not only is it not harsh on my skin, but I do notice a difference, especially when I stop using it. Um, it really helps keep the congested pores away. It helps kind of keep the blackheads on my nose under control. And then when I do have a breakout, it does help it heal faster, but without really, you know, doing that like super drying of the skin. So it's just more gentle overall. So if you are looking for something that's just less harsh to add to your routine, I highly recommend this. So that is it for this video, just super short and sweet. I hope that it gave you some ideas for maybe new products or tools to try out to help kind of keep your skin under control if you have issues like mine. If it does help, please let me know. Or if you have any other products that are similar that you think that I should try out, I'm, all, I'm like you, I'm always on the hunt for another product, you know, maybe one that works a little bit better. So just let me know. Thanks.